Denver, authorities say a suspect shot and killed four people and injured three, including a police officer, in a shooting spree Monday night that began in Denver and ended in a nearby suburb after a gunfight with police in which the suspect was killed. The very violent series of events across multiple locations began in Denver and ended in nearby Lakewood, said Paul Pazin, Denver police chief, at a press conference late Monday. John Romero, spokesman for Lakewood Police, described the scene as still very fresh with a lot of moving parts. We still have a lot of details that we're sorting out at this point, Romero said late Monday. Here's what we know now five people died, including the suspect, authorities said. The people were injured, including a police officer. Police said it was unclear if a Lakewood agent fatally shot the suspect. The shooting spree began just after 5 p.m. in Denver, Hazen said. At a first location, the suspect fatally shot two women and injured a man, he said. At a second shooting location, the suspect fatally shot a man. There was gunfire at a third location, but no one was injured, Pazin said. Pazin said officers identified a car associated with the suspect and exchanged gunfire with them at a fourth location. Pazin said the suspect disabled the police vehicle and fled to the nearby suburb of Lakewood, Colorado. Lakewood police received a call of shots fired at a business just before 6 p.m., and the victim was pronounced dead, Romero said. Lakewood agents identified the suspect's car, but the suspect opened fire on the agents and left on foot, Romero said. The suspect then threatened another business with a firearm before entering a Hyatt hotel and shooting the clerk, who was taken to a hospital, he said. The suspect left, shooting a Lakewood police agent in the process. The suspect died in Lakewood, Romero said, but it was unclear if a Lakewood agent fatally shot the suspect.